Chef Fred D'Angelo. Ben Wong. How's it going, man? Very good. good Ola restaurant, you. huh? Yes, sir. Way out here in the country. Ola at Turtle Bay. Hey, we miss you in Waikiki, but hey, what's on the menu? The togarashi glazed salmon. So basically all you do, you just get a, a vacuum pack sealer, pop in your marinade of oil, which is, we have ginger, cilantro, and lemongrass in olive oil. Mm -hmm. Okay, very simple. Pop that in and then you just, now it's all ready, ready to go. We're gonna go ahead and start that in our just boiling water. It's actually just simmering. And we're gonna get that going on low heat. Okay, now what we're gonna be starting is our Fur Blanc sauce that goes with it. Start with a little bit of white wine. Well, this has got all the ingredients I like. Okay, we've got cold butter, we've got, uh, we've got olive oil, we've got all the, the right fats so far. Yeah. Besides rich king salmon. Now to but, this. But that's omega fatty three oils, right? Yeah, it's good for you. It's good for that's you. That's a good fat. We're gonna add in some fresh thyme. We have some lemongrass. We're gonna squeeze. A lemon, okay? And then we're gonna reduce that to until um, it's almost dry, all right? So we're gonna add a little bit more fat, a little bit of touch of cream, all right? <laughs> and add a touch more wine. Okay, so all I have is an edamame. I have our corn relish, and now we're gonna add in our Kahukasi asparagus. That's interesting stuff. You know, and the neat thing about this too is because of the natural salty flavor, since it's grown entirely in the ocean water, you don't really need to add that much salt. Okay, and then our mixed bell peppers. All the primary colors, huh? Yeah. We're gonna add the potatoes in at the end. Just gonna get that on a nice little low saute. Using Okinawan potatoes, huh? Yes, we are. That color is just so beautiful on them. Okay, now for our beurre blanc, gonna add in a little touch of cream. And all that cream does is just help stabilize it so mm -hmm. that the butter just stays in. Okay, bring that temperature up a little bit. Okay, at this point, we're gonna add in our potatoes. Ooh, everything's looking good, Chef. Okay, and just a little pinch, salt and pepper. We're <clears> gonna <throat> take this out. We're gonna pop this out of the bag. Perfect, you've lost none of the flavor to the, the poaching water. Look at that. Ooh, it's beautiful. Now for our glaze, what we're gonna do, is we're gonna add in a touch of sugar. Such a touch of brown cane sugar. Okay, white is, sugar, brown it's sugar? It's both cane sugar, right? And togarashi. Togarashi being? Japanese chili f seasoning. So there's roasted chili peppers in it, uh -huh. as well as roasted orange peel, and different sesame seeds, and actually some dried seaweed too. Okay, so I'm gonna have you mix that up, and then you're gonna sprinkle a little bit right over the salmon. Oh sure, I'm not gonna sprinkle a little, I'm gonna use a lot of this. I okay. like this. I'm gonna start putting the plate together. Here's the fun part. <laughs> Playing with fire is always fun. Okay, and then what we do, we actually caramelize it very similar as if you were making a creme brulee. Glazes in what, 10 seconds or less? Just about. Our base of our nice, beautiful vegetables. What a nice collection of colors. Okay. That sea asparagus is beautiful. Gonna drizzle our sauce. Now, typically, what I would do is strain all of these components out. Mm -hmm. Okay. What we also have here is a nice little balsamic reduction. Just give it a little color offset. Hey, for a lot of us, you can stop right there. Yeah, it's, that's a meal in itself already. Touch that up a little bit. Now we have just some nice little Asian slaw, Julian carrot, shiitake mushroom, some Julian wow, snow that's peas. nice. That's a nice, nice combination of colors. And then we just go ahead and pop it up with a nice little touch of sea asparagus. And that right here is our togarashi glaze, New Zealand king salmon. Okay, well, I'll tell you what, let's take a break. Okay. And then we'll get right back and let all you guys out there know if this tastes as good as it looks. Man. Hey, welcome back to the show, folks. If you just joined us, we're with Chef Fred D'Angelo at Ola Restaurant in the, the Kuilima Turtle Bay Hotel. Yep. Chef, awesome job. Can you please describe this again for us? Sure can. What we have is our togarashi glazed, olive oil poached, New Zealand king salmon, bit of Okinawan sweet potato, cuckoo corn, and cuckoo sea asparagus, lemongrass per blanc. 
Tell you what, that dish is as pretty as a picture, oh, but very good. this is where we find out. Go ahead and taste it up, Ben. Okay. If you yeah. have any questions, you can also go ahead and check me out. Our website is olaislife.com. Awesome, awesome. Yeah. Okay. Whew, look at this, perfect. Chef, awesome job. Thank you. Tell you what, it was worth every minute of the ride out here. And it was a pretty ride, by the way. Yeah, it's not that bad. <laughs> Thanks for being on the show. We want to say thank you to all the fishermen who are on the show and everybody else. We'll see you next week on Let's Go Fishing. Aloha. Uh, can I finish eating this? Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs>